Hey guys, what's going on? Hope you're having a good day, and I hope you got to enjoy some of the soccer games today. Um, actually, let me know in the comments below what teams you're cheering for and uh, what teams you enjoy there. Maybe we can get some uh, friendly uh, banter going there in the comments about our teams there in the World Cup. But this video, guys, we're going to talk about Tron TRX, and we're going to talk about a few things. We're going to talk about why we think TRX will reclaim its position in the market shortly, okay, because we know before... It was skyrocketing up there, but it's been holding pretty strong in the top 10. We're also going to talk about why a market decline does not worry. It doesn't seem to worry these Tron holders. It's a very strong community, and that's a very good thing, right? Not a lot of weak hands in Tron. So that goes to show who's involved in Tron, people that are really in it for the, the long run with their TRX, okay? They're not just looking for a dump. And finally, we're also going to talk about why Tron TRX is destined, some people say, to take over the world in terms of technology and crypto and this could be happening in about well the start of it will be in less than a week when we get our token migration going guys okay so that's something to remember too the token migration we're going to be switching off the erc20 coins into their own platform so you're going to have to have your tron as scary as it seems on one of the supported exchanges okay and we'll talk about that we're going to do another video in the next little while about the token migration just to reinforce and remind people what they need to do so they don't miss that so it's seamless for everybody but some good news there about the migration, guys, is Binance is saying that they'll do a continuous exchange. So people that missed the deadline, they'll still have a chance to migrate their new uh, their coins into the new TRX tokens. And I think Tron themselves is saying they're going to have an over-the-counter exchange. Okay, And I'll have that information in another video for you guys, so don't worry about that. But we've had a lot of changes, guys, lately in Tron TRX. It's basically been one of the most remarkable cryptos in the whole market, and not only because of its top performance, it's really holding strong in the top 10, but basically, guys, because of the activity of this company, okay? There's not too many companies that are doing what Tron does in terms of keeping people um, up to date with the news, too, and being publicly active out there, communicating with their own community, okay? So it really differentiates from the rest of the market and the other projects. We know back in March, guys, the company successfully deployed its testnet, okay? So that was recently followed by the launch of the mainnet, and that was something the community was anxiously waiting. So because this whole market's been kind of bearish recently, right, we've been in a real bear market pull down, we didn't get the boom we should have, we thought we would see basically, right, coming off the mainnet launch, but that's okay, it was successful, it works, the technology, we're kind of now into the crypto world, focused more on the technology more than just hype and rumors, okay? So another thing that really affected us, guys, a lot of people don't know, is the coin rail hacking recently. That just occurred, and that affected the entire industry. And basically, you know, even the leader of the sector, Bitcoin, lost a lot of momentum. There was no way out of this, okay? Once, once those hacks happen, it really affects the market. And then all the altcoins are inevitably taking a massive hit, a massive drop. And we saw that across the board, guys. So that's something else to be thinking of. There's so much happening now when people think, oh, there's a lot of news about these coins, but the prices aren't going up. Well, I think some of that newbie mentality we're going to be losing soon, okay? We're going to be more into this crypto world for the long term and necessarily news. It will be good. There will be news that helps people like the coins go up and get a little price surge and things like that. But more we're going to be focused on technology and real active world usage, okay? So this company, you know, Tron is doing everything to complete the migration this month without any problem. And this is some amazing news, guys. They even offered a 10 million bounty to whoever finds any security bug in the mainnet Odyssey 2.0 because they want to make sure there's no issues, right? Nothing interferes with our TRX migration. That's amazing. That just goes to show the lengths they're going to go to to make this seamless, like a seamless migration, how, what they care about the technology, how they care about the community, and how they care about the project, okay? They're not fooling around. So that's good news too. Now, if this token journey happens with any problem, that's going to be something very good for TRX, and hopefully we can recover some of the lost ground that many of the investors, you guys, myself, and everybody have been waiting for, and we start regaining confidence out there in the crypto world with respect to this coin, TRX, very quickly. Now, something else I want to talk to you guys about is the company also is going to deploy a super representative, well, you know, it's going to deploy its super representative elections, but this event is really going to help create an autonomous community for the token, which we have, we don't see out there, okay, in this space. So in regards to the migration, we're going to have probably, I think there's utmost guys I've read about 27 exchanges that have offered their support to the coin. 
and you know the most famous Binance. So that's really good. But if we get this autonomous community after this migration with the super representative elections, that's going to be something that really sets us apart in the market there. And hopefully we can reclaim our one of our top positions in the market soon. So something we talked about before and a lot of people are really interested in, I'm getting comments all the time saying, Mike, this is really interesting for Tron and what can that do for us, was the news of BitTorrent. Okay, now we know Justin Sun bought the P2P file sharing site recently. And this BitTorrent acquisition is undoubtedly going to be a massive user base like addition to Tron Network. Okay, we're going to get a massive user base ad addition. Because the merge is not only going to be like a positive thing for Tron, but TRX holders. We're also going to end up holding a high valuable tangible asset. Okay, because this peer to peer. It's going to give us peer-to-peer -peer advertising opportunities. So if you learn more about P2P, uh, P2P a little later, we can talk about that in other videos, but it's very exciting, guys. And that's what Tron's focused on. So basically, we're going to take this step soon, hopefully, in Tron. It's in the interest of both Tron and us, the users. So that's pretty interesting news, too, guys. Now, because of these dips in the prices, people are panicking and people are thinking, oh, you know, what's going on with Tron? What's going on with Tron? But like I said earlier in the earlier in this video when we started, we haven't seen a huge sell-off. So that's really good. Our community's strong. But there is a little bit of panic across the whole market because people are, you know, it's been it's been a long run, hasn't it, in this bear market. But just rest assured, guys, if you've been in crypto for a while, these pullbacks have happened before and we've always, over the last, you know, six, seven, eight years, we've always come back out on all-time highs. We eventually reach them. So, you know, we've seen Tron at 21 cents or so, I think, before, guys, and we should be shooting up way higher than that. It was even a little higher than that, I think, but our new all-time highs, who knows how high they can go in the future, right? So the coming days could be very, very good. And if we're going to start slipping out of this bearish market, that's going to be very good. And, you know, basically, that's going to allow, once once we get out of this bearish market and the, the platform is working great and we have new dApps, that are running on the platform and hundreds of others are flooding in and we can that you know we can expect this after the migration so that's going to be pretty interesting too now basically this value we're looking at right now i have a lot of people saying you know should i get tron at this price i think guys this value of tron right now for myself i mean you'll have to do your own research like i want to make sure anyone new to you know our channel right now remember this isn't financial advice um, i'm not a financial planner um, or advisor what I am is a long-term cryptocurrency enthusiast, and I enjoy sharing my opinions, sharing news, and connecting with other crypto enthusiasts out there so we can help each other and share information. Just make crypto friends all around the world, but you're going to have to do your own research and you know, consult with financial advice if you're going to be making good investments with your money, okay? So don't, don't take these people on YouTube or all over the internet in these crypto worlds as financial planners, okay? But we can meet a lot of great people that can share a lot of information with each other, so that's for sure, and do our own research. Now... This is very good, guys, the price right now, because, you know, if this token becomes a utility coin on the mainnet, then the value of TRX is not going to last too long this cheap, okay? And when all these dApps start migrating over to our mainnet, that's going to really affect the price. And surely we're going to reach new stratospheric prices in terms of value. So I think this market decline we've had, basically, it's very good because it's allowed Tron guys and a lot of other projects that you're involved in, that I'm involved in too, it's allowed the companies basically like we've never seen before to really focus on a solid product okay in terms of mainnet platforms and other things that the other like currencies are switching to like with mainnets and things like that and they can focus on that the technology and the product rather than just token performance through hype and speculation okay and that's really how the crypto markets always run there's projects that have no platforms no products no services and you know, there's a lot of a lot of news and people talking about the tokens' performance. And we've seen some of these coins. You can see them now; they're up there and they're valued very high, and they shouldn't be. But that goes to show that we're going to shake out, shake some of those out of the crypto world. We've seen that over. If you've been in crypto like we have over the years, you'll see that they disappear. They come. There'll be new ones. But the crypto market's maturing right now, guys. So it's good to really put your effort into finding good technologies and people. You know. Um, people that are behind the technology that have some real knowledge of those in of those industries and they can be disruptive in these industries okay and those are where we're going to see the big big gains okay so that's really good i like that that we're really focused on the market performance than just you know and the product development than just coin prices coin prices so it's been a good time for that and trx believers um probably if you this has been one of your favorite projects 
And we know the team's been working hard on the main net and they're really committed to us getting this new main net guys with no flaws so the migration goes over really good. It's probably a good time, maybe. I mean, I'm thinking about accumulating some more TRX. So let me know in the comments below, guys, if you're accumulating as we're speaking or if you plan to accumulate more or if you're just very happy with your position right now. And that's fine if you are. So also, guys, if everything goes smoothly in a little while, in, in a couple days, and everyone's talking about world domination of Tron as the crypto like to the moon, right? This could be the platform of choice for developers of dApps because, you know, Justin Sun and his whole foundation, they're making sure this is a solid, solid platform, okay? So, and they know this should be able to achieve as much as 2,000 transactions per second with basically little to no fees when transacting on the mainnet. So that's going to be a preferred option for many users and dApp creators. And basically, a user, you can initiate up to 25 transactions a day for free. So, and you can create a new account and requires a small coin burn of like 0.1 TRX. So basically, not too much, okay? And also... The blockchain technology of all around the world is huge, but a vast community of this whole blockchain technology and the followers are in the Tron ecosystem, okay? And they're all believers of Justin Sun. So, you know, that the, the amount of people in Tron and the believers following Justin Sun and following Tron TRX is growing every day. And that's really good because the community is huge. It's currently about 1. I don't know, 1.2 million TRX holders. So furthering the claim that Tron is like one of the largest crypto communities out there. So if not already the largest, okay? So that's pretty exciting, guys. Information about Tron. I love hearing your guys' views of Tron, your opinions of Tron. Let me know in the comments below. And also, guys, what we're also going to do is give a little heads up about a coin we're making a video about a little later. And one that we think we could see 10x, 100x, maybe 1,000x gains. Something we're looking into is called Car Vertical. I've talked about it before. We won't get too much into it in this video because I know you came here for Tron news. So that's something that I'm not going to make you listen to or watch in case you're not interested. You can see it in the next video if you are. But we're going to do this with some of the projects that we're looking into to try to find some more gems in there for you guys and for ourselves. We're trying to research them for ourselves, and I'll share that with you if I find anything. And then if you're interested in them, in them, go do your own research, okay? Dig a little deeper and see what you think about it for yourself. But Car Vertical is going to be very disruptive in the automotive industry, especially about pre-owned cars, which is something that has global adoption, okay? All over the globe, every country, people are dealing with the same issue, and it has a little bit to do with pre-owned cars. And we can imagine how blockchain could be very powerful in that, thinking about knowing who's owned the cars, what's happened to cars, if there's been in, if they've been in accidents, mileage, things like that. Things that before have been very hard to get this information shared between people, especially if cars have gone between cities, states, or countries even. Okay, so that's something we're going to do in the next video. But guys, let me know what you think about Tron in the comments below. I hope you have a great day wherever you are around the world. Leave me a comment telling me what you think about the World Cup if you are a big soccer follower and um, who you think uh, we should be watching in the World Cup. Who's your favorite team? Who you're cheering for? And I will see you in the next video, guys. Please like the video if you could. I appreciate that. It helps us out a lot. And make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can get all of our videos as they come out. And you can be part of our community and send private messages and, you know, send DMs so we can contact each other very easily that way. And one other thing I want to mention, guys, a little bit of crypto advice to anyone new in the community or even if you've been in for a while. Protect your crypto and protect yourself. Get yourselves an offline hardware wallet such as maybe a ledger they're one of the best in the industry and i say this because just recently last week there was another major hack hack of an exchange affected the whole market but more than that it affected a lot of individuals who lost their coins okay if you don't protect yourself and protect your crypto at any day you could check any morning any afternoon or evening they could be gone to an exchange hack an exchange goes down or your computer is hacked and as horrible as that would be to wake up and see that your crypto is gone, can you imagine the feeling you would have maybe one, two, three years later when you're checking the prices of these coins that you had hundreds or even thousands of and you see the prices are in the tens of dollars, hundreds of dollars or even thousands of dollars and you imagine what could have been in the profit and the wealth that you've lost just by not protecting your crypto, okay? So it's something I know I'm always going to reinforce people. It's kind of like... Um, almost an obligation I feel to people in crypto that don't know about it because too many people are losing almost a billion dollars worth of crypto was stolen last year alone. So, and altogether, it's just insane the amount of crypto that's lost. So the best investment you can do for yourself, guys, and instead of worrying about prices of everything, 
for all the money you're putting into crypto, put a little bit into your sanity so that you can sleep nice at night and get yourself an offline hardware wallet. We actually put a description in the description below these videos. We'll have a link where you can go directly to the websites and grab one of those because if, if you're interested in getting one, I hope you are because you can just get one right from the factory where you know it's never been tampered with and it'll come right to you because there's a lot of horror stories too about people buying them from other websites and things like that and they've come tampered and oh, it, there's nightmares out there, guys. But it's the best piece of advice I could give anyone in crypto. No matter what you're going to do in the future, protect the crypto you have now so you can sleep nice at night. Okay, guys, and I'm going to get to you again in the next video about Car Vertical. So check that one out if it's something you're interested in. It's something that we're looking at because I think there could be some big gains there. And I hope you have a great rest of the day wherever you are, and I will see you in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.